On this episode of Salt Lake Insider, we're at the biggest house on the 2017 Parade of Homes over in Holiday. We're sitting down with Tree Haven Homes, the builder of this thing. Check it out. On this episode... Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Salt Lake Insider episode number five. I'm super excited for this one. We are at the biggest home in the 2017 Parade of Homes in Holiday. And I'm sitting here with Jerem and Jesse from Tree Haven Homes. These guys actually built this thing and you've got to see it in person. Maybe you already have been to the parade and you've been by here, but these are the guys who are behind this house and, and so I'm just excited to hear their story, what, you know, how they got started building homes, and, and then we'll talk a little bit more about this house. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Dustin Brome. I am a real estate agent here in Salt Lake, and I'm the founder of Search Salt Lake and the host of this show. So, um, Jerem, how long have you been building homes for? So I've, I've, been, uh, I've been a general contractor since 2004. 2004. Okay. I've had my GC license since 2004. I've been building homes since I was in diapers. My dad's had a company for oh, close to 45 years now. And okay. uh, me, my brother, my sisters, we were always out on the job site. The only time we could see my dad, be with my dad, was on the job site. That's cool. Fondest memories that I have with my dad, uh, beginning memories are on the job site. You have a little uh, hard hat? Yeah, we have our, we have our, uh, we have our outfits. Nice. <laughs> that's another. That's another story. Nice. Yes, it is. So, so this particular house. Um, tell us real quick, Jesse, about this house. What is it like? Twelve thousand square feet. Just over twelve thousand. So there's enough space. There is. Yeah. Um, so, what are some of the for people who haven't seen it yet who really need to come see it? What are some of the most exciting aspects of it? Your favorite aspects of the home. Um, Get these guys excited about coming to see it. Well, what we love about the Holiday Haven is it's kind of, it's got something for everybody. Um, so the kitchen behind us, which is one of my favorite features of the home, it is got the largest island we've ever built. It's a 12 foot island, wow. uh, plenty of room for entertaining friends and um, just a real comfortable room. Um, we love that it's got this beautiful outdoor living space a swimming pool, go-kart track, trampoline, um, so something for the outdoor enthusiasts. Sure. Um, the basement has one of the coolest theaters we've ever built. Um, it's got the, the best screen and sound on the market right now. Nice. And just something for everybody. It's a house for entertaining. It's amazing. Now, what was, if you could pick one thing about this house that's your favorite, what is it? Ooh, that's tough. I gotta narrow it down to one. I would probably say the go-kart track. Nice. Or the ball pit. <laughs> I haven't seen the ball pit yet. The ball pit's pretty cool. That is cool. Yeah, my, uh, my 10 year old walked up to the ball pit. I told him to jump in. He thought, no, I'm too cool for that, Dad. So I ran up behind, I picked him up, and I chucked him in, and he just disappeared. <laughs> right. It, it is a, it is, it's, it's a fun ball pit. It was one of the one of the homeowners late, late, late requests and we had to try to fit that into the scope somehow. You gotta have a ball pit. Yeah. How deep is it? It's about four and a half feet. It's a deep ball pit. Yeah, it's enough to get lost in. I'm gonna have to go jump in. Lose your change, your <laughs> right. keys, your phone, yeah, you get it all. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, so this obviously isn't the first home you've built. Yeah, that would be very impressive. But you guys have been, you're not newcomers to the Parade of Homes. You've been in it, what, six years? Yeah, we've been uh, we've been doing the parade since 2012. Okay, um, been uh, very fortunate to build some incredible homes for the parade, and for some very incredible families. Um, the uh, the parade home that we're in today is uh, is one of our favorites by far. It's got some some neat uh, um, some neat features. Obviously, with a go kart track and a ball pit, you can't. You can't stray too far from that and have it not be epic. Right. The fireplace, fireplace is, uh, it's something that the, the homeowners told us that they wanted to model after the St. Regis up in Deer Valley. So we think we did pretty good with that on a very moderate budget for the fireplace. 
with regards to what St. Regis spent. Sure. Yeah, they, they spent a couple bucks. Just yeah. a few. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I think, I think that uh, you know, our, our whole fascination with the parade, it spun off of uh, um, you know, a, a different dynamic that, that I had expected. I've been going to parade homes since I was young. Um, Jesse and I met, we started going to parade homes. Um, I think she fell in love with them as much as I did. And, uh, you know, we, 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 we created this family business. Um, Jesse obviously running the, the office side of things and working a lot with the clients. Um, she's got a degree in finance and, uh, and I've got my construction experience. So nice. we're, we've become a really good duo and we found that um, maybe later on in our, in our marriage as she was very career oriented and uh, um, kind of your executive type of uh, personality and and how that how that came to be with our with our company once we had once we had started putting things together and our two heads together realizing that that integral piece that maybe I missed or the integral piece that maybe she missed worked really together good together once we put them and shaped them so do you think once you guys um, teamed up like that that business started to get better and you started to Definitely. to really Absolutely. step it up a notch. Yeah, we've been fortunate to add cool. each year just new opportunities with new homes and um, we've been really fortunate to work with a lot of great people and we've um, been able to win some awards and, and take some of the, um, get some of the best in show awards and so that's um, developed a lot of momentum and so um, usually we um, always have our parade homes planned out one to two years in advance and um, cool. we kind of centralized our, our marketing on the parade and it's been great we've enjoyed it very cool so it even even though I'm in real estate I've never quite understood the parade of homes and yeah I didn't realize you could plan years in advance to be in it or it, do you have to like enter to be chosen how does that work no, you, you, anybody can enter a home into the parade. Obviously, there's a cutoff in which how many homes really the parade or the Home Builders Association wants to yeah. accept. Uh, but seldomly will you ever experience any homes that, are, um, that, 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 don't, that don't receive that. Um, if you enter it early enough in the game, you're pretty much a shoe in Okay. Uh, they like to see bigger homes because we don't get as many yeah. in the parade each year. Uh, so that's always something that's and that's crowd important. Pleasers. Yeah, it's a fascination yeah. for people. people they want to go through and dream about you know maybe one day. Well, it, this is one of the most impressive houses I've seen in a long time. It just from the design to the the location, these ceilings. How how tall are so these? We're twenty one feet. Twenty one foot to ceilings. The top. Yeah. And usually when you get a typical, you get your typical two-story, you end up around 18 or 19 feet. Yeah. But 21 feet, that gave us 10 feet on the main and 10 feet on the second floor. That's crazy. So you guys, um, you don't do spec homes, right? You just, whenever somebody comes to you and they want a home built, that's, that's what you do, right? Right. We don't okay. spec during the parade. Yeah, pretty okay. much. We'll, we'll do a couple a year um, okay. just as we have um, lots that we want to keep moving, but yeah, mostly we're um, a custom build, and um, or we build, um, someone will have a lot, and they'll come to us and say we're looking for a builder, and that's um, the majority of what we do. Okay, cool. So every once in a while, people can find one of your homes that's actually, that they can buy. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's cool. Yeah. yeah, Lehigh right now is a, it's, there's a lot of growth going in Lehigh, and yeah. so we will be doing quite a bit of speculation homes the next year or two down there, and um, yeah, we look forward to kind of growing into Utah County as well. We're primarily based here in Salt Lake County, but we'll also travel a little bit. Awesome. So this house, this house has some smart home technology that I understand is pretty unique to say the least. And it, it's a local smart home uh, vendor who, who designed it and, and uh, I can't even explain it. You could probably explain it better than me. Yeah, so it's, it's a, it has smart home capabilities that that you don't typically see in most homes. Sure, uh, more than just a Nest thermostat or a correct or a ring doorbell. Yeah. yeah, and a lot of people think, oh, if we have the Nest or um, uh, bird's eye, or if we have <clears throat> security, that we've got smart home. Right, and they do. Uh, but when you come through a home like this, 
Uh, for instance, this home um, packages the same system that uh, Steve Jobs had in his yacht, or has in, in the yacht that, uh, that he was having built before he passed away. Wow. And he didn't even live to see it. So this is the exact same smart home package that you'd, that you'd see in there. The system is the same system, at least. Hmm. And uh, capable of controlling quite a bit. If you come into this parade home, you can ask us to pull up the app and we can show you the one single app. It's not many, it's one single app. You pull it up and it will control every function of the home. Love so, it. Yeah, even the, even the master shower is, is controlled wirelessly. <laughs> How does that work? The steam and the audio. It, okay. It, believe it or not, or this, is, this is one of the first showers that I've installed that had, in order to even turn on the water to test it, yeah. we had to be connected to the internet. <laughs> so it was, it, it, it's funny, it's a really, uh, really nice shower. Uh, you can program several different phases of it online. So that when you go to take your shower, you hit one button and it'll go massage mode or shower mode or whatever mode you want to set it up for. It's a, it's a pretty neat shower. If you've ever been in the Grand America, they have a shower called the Experience Shower. This is much like that. Nice. <laughs> I have not heard of that. Yeah, it's pretty neat. That's cool. Awesome. All right. So um, if you guys have not been to... And you, this home has a name, right? Is it Holiday Haven? Holiday, Holiday Haven. The Holiday Haven home. If you guys have not been to, the, to Holiday Haven during this year's Parade of Homes, definitely get here. It's, it's so cool. Um, I'm going to go take, I'm going to go check out the ball pit after this. Probably jump in and lose my phone. But <laughs> thank you guys very much, Jerem and Jesse with Tree Haven Homes. Um, you guys did an amazing job. You absolutely knocked it out of the park. Thank you. Thank you, you, thank you very much. Come you see bet. us. Yeah. Thanks, guys. It's been um, Salt Lake Insider episode number five. Thank you very much.